All right, Kirsten Anderson, our toyologist from the Village Toy Shop in Port Moody is with us and she's handed us fistfuls of dice. Yes. Which, yes. Uh, this is the award-winning Tenzi game and it is, they claim to be the fastest game out there. Hmm. So what we, everyone has, like there's enough for four people to play this, but you could get extra packs and play with more people. And what you do is you roll these and what you're trying to do is get all, them all the same. So, as soon as, so you choose what number you're gonna do and mm -hmm. you put those aside and then roll the ones you're not doing. So let's say I've decided to do fours and now I'm gonna roll this. And first oh. person to get all their, the same. I have a full house. Um, <laughs> <laughs> just yells tenzi. Like double yeah. So you just keep yeah. going until you've got until you've got it. So it's super, like super tenzi. fast and they tenzi and you might be within seconds you of each other. You have to yell something? You yell yeah, tenzi, tenzi when you get oh, it. Tenzi. Oh, yeah. I've got three left. But great because it's for a wide age range. Uh huh. So, Obviously, yeah. it's occupying us. <laughs> and it's and it very addictive. Numbers. It makes numbers. <laughs> we might fun. never get off of 10 days. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay, now I'm. I got a full house, too. So, that is a, a really cool <laughs> one that's just been selling. I mean, it would fit in a stocking right. perfectly, right? Mm -hmm. uh, we have one puzzle here. The rest are, are games for the holiday seasons, but this is a new uh, invention, which is augmented reality puzzle. So, you complete the puzzle, then you use your iPhone or your iPad, too, and when you go over the puzzle, you can see video footage of it kind of moving. What? Yeah. Come really. On. And that's by Ravensburger, which but what is if you uh, lose one little piece? made in Germany. Is that <laughs> like the Christmas lights, one You're not going to be the whole the scene of. So they have Paris and Africa and ocean, cool. beautiful wow. puzzles. Yeah, that's very cool. Seven Wonders is uh, an award-winning game from Europe. It's like one of the number one games in Europe right now. And uh, what you're doing is building ancient civilizations. And we had our first video um, review of this game so people can go on our website and see the details of how it's played because mm -hmm. it takes about 45 minutes to learn the rules of it. It's an intricate game, even more intricate than Settlers of Catan. This is the junior version. And that's an involved game, but a lot of adults get addicted to Settlers of Catan, so they came out with a junior version. Okay. Now, people looking for a dinner party game, like for a bunch of adults, mm -hmm. uh, pick and choose is a, a fun one that um, we've got out here. So what's neat about this one is you um, get to choose whether you want to draw it, do clay, mime it, hum it, use the wire to to shape it and have people guess what the object is. Mm, interesting. Uh, use one word to get two words or a trivia question. So if you're more of a trivia guy or more of an acting person, that's what you get to choose, but you get different points depending on how difficult it is. Mm. And usually wire, you'd get is the most tough? points. <laughs> yeah. Interesting, and so it's an, a sort of an amalgamation of Trivial Pursuit mm -hmm. and a bunch of the, yeah, Charades, a bunch of the other humming. games. humming, yeah, there. exactly. Yeah. So there's something for every taste in this one. That's what I like about it, because some people Pick are and choose. less extroverted, right, than others, so yes. they have options with this game. Those people are no fun to have board games with. After though. this, then, but you they play, would, then you bring the twister. They can do the trivia <laughs> one, right? <laughs> like yeah. what character is C-3PO sidekick in Star Wars movie? Uh, sorry, I didn't yeah. hear the question. <laughs> Alex, repeat the question. R2D2. <laughs> yeah, All so right. that's a really neat one, too. Ghost is the next Ghost one. Ghost Blitz. Have here. Uh, used to be Geitz Blitz in German, but uh, <laughs> fabulous game. So you look at the card, and you then it's whoever grabs the object first that it's an exact match. So this has a white ghost on it, so it would be first person to grab the white ghost. Hmm. But this one here, there is no blue chair and there is no green ghost. So now you have to find the object on there that has no object and no color match. So it's not this one because there's blue, and it's not this one because there's green, and it's not this one because there's a chair, so it's this one. There's only one right answer, so oh. it's whoever figures it out first and grabs it really fast. Hmm. And this is for which age group? I would say about seven and up. Yeah. It says it gets eight. their little smarter brains than going. Us. Yeah, yeah, smarter than us. It took me yeah. a while to figure yeah. it out. Maybe six. It makes perfect sense when you explain it. Yeah, it yeah. And, and beautiful wooden objects and, and simple to learn, fast to learn, right? Okay. And the Hobbit coming out. Oh, the uh, Hobbit's soon. huge. Yeah. And you can integrate this uh, board game with uh, Lord of the Rings as well. So you could put the two together, uh, which is nice. And Don't Rock the Boat, a balancing game for younger kids. Hmm. You could go three. They suggested five, but as toyologists, we would recommend um, three. And basically, you just balance the penguins on a, on a boat. Okay. And I like the if you don't want them to there. fall off. 
Very the whole good. thing to rock yeah. off. This yeah. guy here. He, you have to dress up like <laughs> a pirate patch, to play right. this. Oh, yes. no, the pirates can fall. <laughs> exactly. My penguins are falling. <laughs> 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 All right, Kirsten, thank you so much. Uh, We're going to see you every Friday from now until every Christmas. Every Friday, right? yes, we'll do stocking stuffers. Next uh, week is the hot new toys of the year. Very good. Yep. Look forward to it. Thanks for that. And, of course, uh, the Village Toy Shop is in Port Moody. There's the phone number and the website, villagetoyshop.ca. Thanks. All right, Barry and I are going to get back to this uh, Tenzi game, yes. Christy. <laughs> oh, yeah? You hear the noise, yeah. that's what it that's is. That's what we're doing. <laughs> yeah. I like the pick and choose. That sounds like a fun game, the pick and choose. You know what? I always love getting games for Christmas because then you'd sit down after dinner and you'd have a game uh, between everyone, and it was always a good time. Yeah. All right, uh, this is the type of thing that you'd want to do on a day like this, that's for sure. Uh, pull out a board game or a puzzle or something. You don't want to go outside. It's pea soup out there. We're at 10 degrees right now, so it certainly is mild, but we're seeing significant rainfall. Uh, there may be some breaks in the clouds a little bit later on today, but for the most part, we're, we're talking about waves of moisture very similar to how we have.